Hi students and welcome back to bankexamstudy.com. Today I am going to review the best books for quantitative aptitude section. So many of you have called me, messaged to me or emailed me to suggest the best book for quantitative aptitude section. So today I am going to review all the, all the books for the quantitative aptitude section. So let's start with the, one of the most popular books for quantitative aptitude section and this is the best seller for, book for the quantitative aptitude section. And this is the book by R.S. Agarwal, R.S. Agarwal, uh, by S. Chan Publication, Quantitative Aptitude by R.S. Agarwal. So, is it a good book? It used to be a good book actually. In 2007, 2008 or 2009, I could say, this used to be, uh, this one was the only book, only good book available in the market. And because at that time in 2007, 8 or 2009 or 10, the level of banking examination, IBPS PO, SBI PO, uh, that was really easy. In those exams, these exams used to be really easy. Even in 2011 or 12, uh, the IBPS PO 2 and IBPS PO 1, I mean, IBPS PO exam started in 2012. Before that, uh, there were there were many exams. I mean, Dina Bank used to ha have a, the separate exam, OBS or Bank of Maharashtra. Each, each of those these banks used to conduct separate examinations. At that time, this book was very useful. But as of now, if I can see, there are 726 uh, pages in, the, in this book and just 50 pages are devoted for the data interpretation chapter. And even for the data interpretation chapter, there are no double diagram data interpretation question, no double diagram data interpretation questions. So, uh, the kind of questions that you are going to find in the in the IBPSP or SBI PO, even in the RBI assistant exam, these are not the kind of questions that you are going to find in the exam. So, sh do I recommend this book? No, I don't recommend this book at all for banking examinations. For state level exams like UP constable or like uh, a cooperative banks uh, examinations or you know state level judiciary. Uh, Judiciary clerk, yes, I mean, Punjab and Haryana clerical, such kind of exams. This is a good book. There are a lot of practice questions in each, in each, each and every chapter. There are like 100, 150 or 200 questions. So I recommend, uh, I, I recommend for those kind of exams, but for the bank exams, this is not a good book at all. Even if you are getting a lot of discount or on Amazon or Flipkart, please don't buy this book at any cost. I mean, I know many of you buy the books after seeing the watching the discounts so this is a very bad strategy don't buy rs agarwal book for banking examinations right so this is the tip number one so second book that i'm going to review is that book by abhijit Gua. actually i'm having like total 18 quantitative aptitude books at my home uh, at my home and, and at my office if i you know combine the numbers at my office as of now I am having 9 books, out of them I am going to review these 5 books. So the second book is by Abhijit Guha, one of the best seller at, uh, at Amazon and Flipkart. This is a good book, right, a very small book but a good book, right. If you just go through its chapters. The only problem that I see in this uh, book is the data interpretation chapter again. There are just uh, 50 pages devoted to data interpretation chapter and the but, but, I am saying but, uh, the level of data interpretation questions is okay, okay, not, not really great but it's okay. You are going to find these kind of questions in the exam. Um, it's okay it's not that great it's it's just okay okay data interpretation part is not great but the remaining book is really 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 amazing you are going to find similar level similar uh, similar questions in the exams the difficulty level is really good uh, you can go for this book if i am going to rate out of 10 for the to the rs agarwal i would give out of 10 i would give like 3 or 4 points to rs agarwal but to this book i would give uh, seven and a half or eight out of ten I'll give this book eight right because of its quality of questions uh, to the quantitative aptitude section but 
the data interpretation part is not great at all right data interpretation part is not great i mean uh, need to improve a lot at the data interpretation part otherwise this book is really good you can buy it it is by magra magra hill education and that rs agarwal's book is by s chand uh, it is heavily marketed right the rs agarwal book but uh, i don't recommend that book at all uh, actually i get a lot of books uh, by publishers for free i mean they send their books to at our office for free uh so this is this is one of the books that i got for free uh, by uh, khurmi i got this quantitative attitude book by khurmi publication for free normally whenever i buy any quantitative attitude book because this is my profession right i need to go through all that books available in the market i go through i have gone through like 17 18 or 20 books uh most of the times i give like 7 to 8 days like 5 to 6 hours a day 7 to 8 days to each of the, the available books uh but this is this one is the exception on the very first day i just gave like 30 minutes and i i got my <laughs> decision that this is this book is not worth my time so i just threw it away so this book is still new i <laughs> mean i purchased that i got that i didn't purchase i got that book for free i mean uh, last year but this book is still new i mean Uh, many students come to my office and i mean i have few friends like they come to my office and they borrow my books right and most of them don't return my books but uh, nobody just got this book as once uh, one of my friends just requested me to give the uh, to uh, to get this book and i told him buddy don't get this one this is a really i mean this is a show piece right i just show this in my almira so this is the kind of book that you shouldn't buy at any cost this book is available at discounts but avoid this at any cost if even somebody is giving you this book for discount don't get it so let's let's move on to the next book this is by r gupta uh this book is like again the uh, this one is a younger brother of r s agarwal this r gupta's quantitative aptitude book is a younger brother of r s agarwal i mean uh, they try to you know uh, they are not copying the r s agarwal book but they try to copy the concept of r s agarwal book easy questions a lot of easy questions 200 250 questions are available in each and every every chapter so so i call this book the younger brother of r s agarwal's book the price is like this is a huge book see the price is 495 and i think this book is available for around 370 380 at amazon or flipkart this is a huge book 750 pages book again not many questions for data interpretation and data interpretation is i think not available at uh, now it is available just 50 pages of data interpretation out of 760 pages and no double diagram questions again same as rs agarwal's book no double diagram questions a uh, few probability questions are there trigonometry ratios are there few questions but all in all this is a really easy book um really easy book a lot of question lot of easy questions you can use this book for state level exams or up police i again told you up police or some state level such state level or cooperative banks exam but for rbi rbi assistant sbi po ibps po bank of baroda manipal or such kind of exam exams i don't recommend this book out of 10 i would give like just uh, 3 points because this one is a younger brother of rs agarwal so r gupta by quantitative aptitude don't buy this book i i got this book for free and this is not a good book at all and the last uh, and the one one of the most important book this is actually a small book by team bank exams today this one is actually out of stock right now but the soft copy is available on bank exams today the quantitative aptitude made easy this is the first edition uh, we just launched last month we launched the third edition uh, the of quantitative aptitude made easy right uh, the data interpretation part is available for free yes the data interpretation Uh, workbook is available for free you can download it for free on bankexamstoday.com just go on just go to bankexamstoday and download that uh, workbook for free yes you heard it right that's available for free uh, we have picked the most important questions just like 25 30 questions and we made the this book and uh, if you have just like 15 20 days for your preparation this is 
uh, this is your best friend right just go for it download it from bankexamstudy.com two books i don't have uh, the two uh, three important books actually three important books as of now at my office i have those books at my home so uh, those three books are the first one is by arun sharma yes arun sharma and uh, yes arun sharma quantitative aptitude by arun sharma uh quantitative aptitude by arun sharma is a good book right uh, it it has a lot of quality questions that the difficulty level at par with the sbi pu and S, uh, sbi pu and ibps pu level exams but uh, but uh, it doesn't have a, it, it don't have that uh, proper solution and explanations to all the questions proper solutions are not available so at the end of the day if you solve few questions and you are not able to you know uh, get a proper solution a proper explanation then there is no point of solving a book so avoid arun sharma's book uh, because arun sharma ji they have a proper uh, coaching institute and they want you to join their coaching center on their online coaching so that's why that uh, book by arun sharma is available in the market um, i'm not criticizing him uh, he's a great writer i used to follow his book uh, when i was appearing for cat and similar even the bank exams 4 5 years back but i don't recommend his book instead of that sarvesh kumar verma this is another amazing book uh, out of 10 i give sarvesh kumar verma 9 no mistakes at all you are not going to find a single mistake in sarvesh kumar verma's book right amazing book but again uh, lack of data interpretation questions but still uh, good quality questions are available in his book I highly recommend the Sarvesh Kumar Verma's book. I don't recommend that Arun Sharma's book or the RS Agarwal, but I highly recommend the Sarvesh Kumar Verma's book, right? And one more book that I am not having as of now, that is by Nishat Sinha. He is a good friend of mine, Mr. Nishat Sinha. Um, right now he is at, uh, I think, in Uttarakhand. He is a faculty at Uttarakhand right now. Uh, I used to follow his book, uh, not to follow, I used to recommend his book, but there are a lot of mistakes in his books, a lot of, uh, there are a lot of mistakes in his books. I mean, if you are just started solving the problem, you are going to find a lot of mistakes and the difficulty of, difficulty level of questions is really, really very high, much higher than uh, banking and uh, IBPS PO, SBAP or Bank of Roda exam. The difficulty level is really, really very high. So um, I don't uh, recommend the Nishat Sinha's book. Don't follow that book, right? Uh, another bestseller book that uh, that uh, tell you about is the Magical Book by M. Tyra. There is nothing magical about M. Tyra's book. Just mark my words. Uh, the book by M. Tyra is one of the worst books. I mean, if I if you ask me to rate that book out of hundred, I would give it zero. They actually, uh, in that book, you will get like uh, 10, 12 or 20 methods to solve a single question, right? Uh, even for the time, it's simple time and work chapter, x uh, multiplied by y, multiplied by 2y, over 4x, 3x, y, I don't know. They made weird uh, uh, formulas for these simple aptitude questions and named it uh, and actually marketed it as we are, they are selling the Vedic Maths book. This is not Vedic Maths magical tricks or magical book by m tyra is not equal to vedic maths vedic maths is a proper science if you want to learn vedic maths there are many good books available in the market that are actually targeting the vedic maths vedic maths is a proper science right the books that are available in the market they are just branding themselves uh, they are just they are trying to you know brand themselves as the brand ambassadors of Vedic Maths but they are not right avoid the magical those these kind of magical books right there there is no magic in the, these kind of books so avoid it at, at any cost right so uh, that's all about the books so let's conclude this which books uh, I recommend the first one Abhijit Guha is a good book Sarvesh Kumar Verma is a good book and quantitative quantitative aptitude made easy the third version is a good book and for the data interpretation part 
the data interpretation workbooks are available for free yes you heard it right the data interpretation workbooks are available for free on bankexamstoday.com just go to bankexamstoday.com and download it for free just go to the description i have provided links to all these books in the description uh, all uh, links to that flipkart and amazon yes I, I provided the links to amazon and flipkart even for that uh, that quantity of aptitude made easy books you will find all these links in the description also the free data interpretation workbooks even that link is available in the free the time and work and number series chapter i have actually provided a proper uh, pdf for these chapters and i have provided the links in the description so that's all for today students uh, before leaving just subscribe to my channel click the subscribe button like this video and if, if you are unable to uh, get the answers to your questions just you know drop a message uh, if you need my number uh, that is 9914968671 you can call me anytime you can mail me raman at the rate of bankexamstudy.com uh, that's all for today thank you and have a nice day bye